In this video, I'll be showing you how to install Windows 7 into a Mac using Bootcamp. So first, open your Safari. Go to the piratebay.org. Search Windows 7 Automate. Right here, you should see a page of Windows 7 Automate. So go ahead and find Windows 7 dot automate dot sp1 dot 32 bit dot x86 dot june dot 2011 by lil user. So this is a version of a uh, cop. This is a copy of Windows that is already cracked uh, with DAZV a uh, version 2.0.3. So go ahead and download this torrent. Right, right here I'm downloading this torrent with speed download. It's now finished. So go ahead and double click the torrent file to download the torrent with uTorrent. If you don't have uTorrent, go to uTorrent.com to get uTorrent in order to uh, download this torrent file. So right here I have my down, uh, torrent file downloading. So I come back when it's 100%. Right here I have my Windows 7 Ultimate SP132 bit ready. It's a ISO file. So what you have to do now is to insert a DVD 4.7 GB in order to burn this ISO file into your DVD or uh, your Mac would ask you if what you want to do if you're on CD just click OK you have your ISO file ready double click to open it and here's the LIL dash file volume of this S uh, ISO uh, file so go to launchpad utilities this utility and then here is the um, volume Click on burn. Select this ISO file from your desktop. Click on uh, double click on it or click on burn. So here is the burn page. Um, now insert your 4.7 GB DVD into your Mac. And then now click on burn. So I come back when it's finished. After the um this finished burning, you should see something like this. The process is burned successfully. So click on OK. And now you insert uh insert your DVD back. You should see something like this. Inside, you have the apps um, auto run, dot I, INF, boot, boot manager, EFI, setup exe, and etc. So now you are uh, reject your reject your DVD and go to Launchpad, Utilities, and click on Boot Camera Assistant. And click on continue and um you don't have your um windows support software for your mac so go ahead and click on download the windows support software for this mac click on continue now it's downloading i'll be back after it's finished now you should see something like this and then it asks you if you want to put into a cd or dvd or save into an external hard drive well, um, I'm going to put it into a DVD that I have over here. So now I in, I plug in my uh, DVD. And 
and then click OK here. I mean, uh, select um, Open Finder and then click OK, and then click on Continue, and click on Burn. So I come back when it's finished. Well, here you should see something like a uh, Helper Two, and then type in your password. You don't, if you don't have one, just click, uh, just press Return, and then. Right here, you, um, the system wants you to select how many gig of your Windows system sh uh, should be. Um, I recommend 32, because this is what usually people do. And uh, I think it's enough for um, your Windows 7 on your Mac. So click on uh, Partition. So now it, uh, the disk is partitioning, so I come back when it's finished. After the partitioning of your um, um, Windows of uh, uh, HD, um, your Mac should be rebooting after you click the start installation. Now Windows is loading files. You just have to wait for it. So I come back when it's finished. Now select your language, time, and currency and uh, keyboard or input method and then click on next and then click on install now setup is starting accept the terms click on next and then click on, click on uh, custom what you want to do now is to uh, select the bootcamp Partition, click on hard drive option and then format and then click on OK. Now you have the NTFS uh, partition for your Windows 7 and then click on next. Now Windows is starting to install onto your Mac and this will be take about um, 30 minutes, I said, so I'll be back after finished. After installation, your Mac will restore, uh, restart automatically. And now, the Windows, start, Windows is starting. Now, enter your name, enter your password, and then click on next. Use recommend settings and then choose your time, time zone, and then click on next. And then uh, join your wireless network. So I'm gonna enter my uh, Wi Fi password over here. Now it's installing the uh, um. Windows loader. It's getting in the um, main page of Windows 7 right now. So here is the brand new Windows 7 on your Mac. Thanks, thanks for watching.